And now we're looking at Jupiter with a 15 millimeter lens. And this is October the uh, 12th, 2013, in Bartlett, Tennessee. may be able to see a couple of Jupiter's moons, but this is a 15 millimeter lens. And we're hoping tonight to be able to see the shadows of the moons, three of the shadows of the moons crossing Jupiter's face. But we're not quite able to pick that out with the 15 millimeter, so we're going to bump up the power here in just a minute. We're going to try the 4 millimeter lens. We're going to go all out here. And yeah, we're pretty sure that that'll work. So we're going to go ahead and try that here in just a moment. And maybe that will enable us to see the shadows of the moons across the face of Jupiter. Again, this is a 15 millimeter lens, 8 inch Celestron, with a flip video camera held up to the lens. <laughs> 